Hello and welcome to the channel IT Simplified. In today's quick video, I will show you how to add a custom domain to your Azure subscription. Let's get started from your Azure main page. You can go to Azure Active Directory. And under the manage, go to custom domain names. Now, when you create your Azure subscription by default, uh, Microsoft create uh, uh, domain for use with the name dot on microsoft.com uh, but the whole idea of uh, having a custom domain is that uh, when you want your uh, employees or your users to access anything you want to have a company branding in my case my domain is it simplified.ca and uh, that is what I'll be adding so go to add custom domain button and over here I'll give the domain name which I own So it's idsimplify.ca and click on add domains and uh, you'll get a uh, uh, notification that uh, the domain name was added let me just close this now the important thing over here is that uh, you can either populate these uh, values it's so why you can either populate these txt or you can go with the mx value but these needs to be uh, populated in the uh, whoever is your registrar for your uh, for your domain name uh, in my case uh, it will be a txt value but feel free to use a txt or mx uh, my registrar is uh, godaddy so as you can see that i own this account so what i will have to do is i have to go to the dns and i have to populate these uh, values to my uh, domain manager and after you have done that you will go back again to your Azure subscription and you will click on the verify button the only thing you have to remember that sometime it takes on an average uh, uh, 24 to 72 hours that is what Microsoft also uh, gives you uh, notification when you try to verify that so if it doesn't verify uh, immediately don't worry about that it is pretty normal it will take some time and when all the values are populated you will see that uh, uh, your ID simplified as you can see it is unverified right now uh, it will be uh, status will be available and it will be uh, registered and then you can make that uh, as a primary domain so that is what how you can add a custom domain name to your Azure subscription I hope you found this video useful thanks for watching have a good day